bottom line is that if we didn't think President Kagame was going to be here for another seven years, we wouldn't even consider doing what we're trying to do. That's the bottom line. Mine. By the way, I didn't ask for this thing at all. <laughs> in fact, this, I have told Rwandans in several meetings, I had several meetings with people in my party, and, and, and I was bringing up the, the, the point you, you've raised that it's not just what they think as Rwandans, it's what other people elsewhere think also about us. Whether we are right, and are very convinced that we are right, in the end you cater for other people's opinions and what they may be thinking about you. And, and the, all this came up for discussion. I was actually trying to tell my people that you know what? There is room you can find somebody else. Maybe you need to take a risk and look for somebody else. You, you are saying you can't let me go, you want me to stay because of you know, whatever the results we have had in the past. Maybe you need to take a risk with somebody else from the, you know, amongst the RPF, you know, cadres or else, elsewhere. And they kept saying, no, we are not ready to take risks. We want you to stay. I said, but I'm having difficulties staying. And anyway, people outside have difficulties with me staying. So about thinking about that. He would say, well, but those same people from outside. <laughs>